What's going on? Hey, Randy, how are you doing? I'm doing great. Yes. Last season was a big year for you. You're a true freshman. You jumped in right away, and I think played in every game. So, what did you learn? Like, what was what was last season like for you? Uh, last season was amazing. You know, just being able to be a young guy that like contributed to you know just winning and de help developing people as a whole, uh, offense and defense. Just, just being able to be a guy that could come in when someone's down or or we need an extra guy being willing to step in on special teams or anything like that. It was just it was just very big for the for the character that I am. Randy, you get a chance to to, to first couple practices with uh, KJ. What what has he brought to this team, and, and how do you feel like he can fit well into this offense? Uh, he he's brought a lot of versatility. Uh, he's definitely a big guy, as y'all can tell. He um he can run well, he can throw the ball well, but uh you know he's really taking in the, in the leadership role like as an offense, just bringing everyone together, making sure everyone's on the same page, uh, making sure that everything is A B C throughout the whole board. So just just being together as a whole and being a unit. Randy, the tight end room is a little shaken up from where it was last year. Obviously, you were the young guy. Um, now you're I think you have the most yards in that room out of anyone. What's it like? Our obviously early spring practice. Uh, I mean, it's been well. Uh, last year was last year, but now it's just time to get better. Now, you know, um, we got Colin Fox came in, just just trying to give some of the game to the young guys and guys that haven't had as much on the field time as me. Just trying to be there for them and teach them some of the things that I've learned from previous players that we've had. What are some of the major things that you're looking to improve on this spring practice? Uh, I'm looking to improve on my blocking. And um, also my leadership, just um, like being a young guy, embracing the leadership role, uh, you know, thinking about being here for the future. Uh, I want to build that, those type of characteristics now. So I'm really looking forward to, to being a leader. How would you care, like, uh, compare this time last year coming into spring ball as a, as a true freshman to where you are right now, like the, the feeling you have about where you are in this team and, and just the you know, pre preparation for spring? Uh, um, I'm definitely confident. You know, uh, I come out every day, though. I'm respecting everyone's game. I'm just trying to come out and, and compete, play as hard as I can, and just give what I got. Renee, I know it's only been two days, but are there any guys kind of standing out to you, either offensive, defensively, that kind of coming in and stepping into a new role where you feel like can help us in the fall? Yeah, uh, Bradell Richardson, uh, Colin Fox, um, Lee Mitchell, Chasen. Chasen is the defensive back. Those guys have been looking really well. They've been moving really well on the field. Uh, I've been with those guys a little bit off the field. They're great guys off the field also. What went into the number change I saw? You went from 13 to 5. Oh, uh, I was originally a single digit in high school. Um, 13 was kind of a, it was a freshman thing. So uh, I, you know, I, like, I like a single digit, so I made the decision to try to switch to a single digit. From the way the season, and, uh, the way the season ended last year uh, compared to now, what are some of the things that as a team that you guys are working on and what's going to set you guys apart? Um, just, just being there for each other. And um, we're going we're gonna to focus hard on um, just having guys that we trust out there. You know, everyone, like, like I said, everyone has to be on the same page, you know, as a whole, just being there for each other, making sure that we're all thinking the same. We all want to be able to think like KJ, know what KJ is doing, so we're all expecting the same diff the same things and, and nothing's different across the board. Randy, when you look back at last season, what was kind of maybe a big moment for you, a turning point when you kind of, you know, rewind last year in your head? Did you have a big game or a big play? What do you kind of think about when you think about your freshman season? When I think about my freshman season, I definitely think about the catch against Oklahoma. <laughs> that's, that's really the... Like one of my biggest plays, like to this day, like in, in any stadium, like it was it was third and long, keep the game going. It was just one of the biggest plays I made in my life. Randy, you talk about you know being a true freshman and then kind of taking some of the younger guys this time around under your wing. What is your advice been to them? I mean, you you experienced the stuff. What are you telling them that they got to look forward to going into the spring practice? Uh, like talking about guys like colleges. Just helping him like grow as an athlete, you know, because a lot of things that you come to college and, and you try to do, you just never done before. So it, it's difficult, it may be uncomfortable, just just getting him used to being able to, to bend and move and use his hands, you know, different stuff like that, just to just to improve his game and make him an elite player. Randy, coming in last year, uh, you guys uh, cut ghost. Coach Malzahn took a bit of a step back on the play call, and this year he's actually taking those reins back. Can you feel the difference in the flow of the offense now that coach is calling the plays? Oh uh, yeah, there, there's definitely a difference. Like um, during offensive meetings, he's making sure everybody's on the same page. Everyone's thinking like a coordinator. KJ's thinking like a coordinator, and now everybody's thinking like KJ. So we're all on the same page there. You step it up in the tight position at the speed. How fast is this offense? Uh, it, it's fast. We, we definitely move fast. Uh, we try to tempo guys as much as we can. Um, just stepping up, it's just been, it's been really fast. Definitely fast. I just trying to adjust. You know, I'm just. Like I said, stepping into that leadership role, just trying to be the guy. So just, just moving forward. 
Hi, last question for Stephen. Jordan Davis has been a player that's dealt with a lot of injuries. What's his presence like being back on the practice field? Uh, he's definitely he's working back into um, getting used to putting a lot of load on his leg, but he's getting back and he's and he's feeling better. You know, um, he hasn't been on the field as much due to injury, like you mentioned. But um, once he get used to just putting his, as much load on his leg, he's going to be a great player for us. Perfect. Thank you. Great job.